Good morning, Whitman. I'm William Fortune reporting for Whitman Shorts. As the NBA postseason begins, I sat down with AD. Now I'm not talking about Anthony Davis. I'm talking about Hall of Famer Adrian Dantley. He is walking around kind of in a daze at the moment as Dantley gets it outside, dumps it down into Eaton, throws the left handed up and down. Adrian Dantley was a professional basketball player who played in the NBA from 1976 until 1991. Dantley played as a small forward and was recognized for creating his own offense and for his intensive force on the basketball court. He was inducted into the Naismith Hall of Fame in 2008. I basically worked hard all my life on my game. I went to the mouth of high school, played for a great coach, Morgan Wooten. When I was in high school, I was trying to get a scholarship. <laughs> And then you take from there. And then you know how good you are, whether you have a shot at it or not. But you just have to work, work on your weaknesses, work on your game, try to be the best you can. He continued his basketball career at Notre Dame, where he played for four years. He graduated with a degree in economics. Well, when I was at Notre Dame, UCLA was the team in college basketball. They had some great players, Bill Walton, Jamal Wilkes. They had an 88-game winning streak. I can remember when we played UCLA right before the game, Bill Walton was really cocky. He was whistling the Notre Dame fight song as he walked by us. We broke that streak. What I enjoyed most about my career was being able to compete against the best players in the world every night. Uh, it was a different guy that I would guard and see how I would do you know, against the best. Adrian Dantley retired in 1991 after a 15-year NBA career and is listed at number 9 on the NBA's total career regular season free throws made list with 6,832 free throws. Uh, I did work in the NBA. I was an assistant coach at Denver Nuggets for eight years. And then when I finished that, that's when I got involved with, you know, the crossing guard and the refereeing. I chose to be a crossing guard. First of all, it was something that I wanted to do. I just didn't want to be retired. I enjoy being around the kids. After doing it for, I guess, seven years now, all the kids know me now. It gets me up in the morning, I don't get lazy. You know, only you know, 30 minutes in the morning, 30 minutes in the evening. It's a great job for me. I've been refereeing. I've been doing it for seven years. I do it basically just to get some exercise in. And I like being around basketball. I like officiating kids, uh, especially 12 and under, seeing who's pretty good. What do I see in today's game that I like? Uh, I think the game is, is pretty good. Everybody loves the three-point ball. That's great. Got a lot of gr great basketball players. And when I do watch, I enjoy watching the games. This has been William Kevorkian of Reporting Fortman Shorts. Have a great time watching the NBA postseason. And I would advise anyone, if you're going to do anything in life, just try to be the best that you can be.